In my previous video, we learned about plants and their parts. In this video, we'll learn more about what are the different types of plants. There are different varieties of plants and they are mainly classified based on certain feature including growth habit. Growth habit mainly refers to the appearance, shape, height and form of growth of a plant species. Today, we will talk about different types of plants based on their growth habit. The first one is herb. The second one is shrub. Third one is tree. Fourth one is climber. And the fifth one is creeper. Now let's learn more about these five different types of plants. Let's talk about herbs first. Herbs are short sized small plants with soft green delicate stems without woody tissues which can be easily uprooted from the soil. They complete their life cycle within one or two seasons, hence shorter life cycle. Generally, they have few branches or are basically branchless. Herbs contain enough nutritional benefits including vitamins and minerals to make them a part of a healthy balanced diet. Many herbs are used as spices and medicines also and few are added during cooking for flavor like parsley. Let's see some examples. Mint Basil Coriander You must have heard all these plants name but now you know these are herbs. The second one is shrubs. Shrubs are medium sized woody plants they are taller than herbs but shorter than a tree. Their features include bushy, hard and woody stems with many branches. Although stems are hard, they are flexible but not fragile. The lifespan of these plants usually depends on the species itself. Let's take a look at some of the examples of shrubs. Rose plant lemon, cotton plant. We sometimes get confused between herbs and shrubs. But remember that herbs are plants with soft and delicate stems and are perennial. Shrubs are taller than herbs and have a hard woody stem with branches. Now we'll talk about trees. Trees are strong, big and tall plants. They have very thick, woody and hard stems called the trunk. This single main stem or the trunk gives rise to many branches that bear leaves, flowers and fruits. The lifespan of a tree is very long that is for several years. Let's take a look at some of the examples. Coconut tree Banyan tree, maple tree. Fourth one are climbers. Climbers have a very thin, long and weak stem which cannot stand upright but they can use external support to grow vertically and carry their weight. So they climb. That is why they are named as climbers. These type of plants use special structures called tendrils to climb. Sometimes they also produce a twine or hook from their leaves to climb. Let's see some examples of climbers. Grapevine Green peas Bitter guard So next time you see these plants, just see what they are climbing on. Fifth one are creepers. Creepers, as the name suggests, are plants that creep on the ground. They have very fragile, long thin stems 
that can neither stand upright nor support all their weight creepers spread their stem leaves horizontally along with the soil on the ground and also bear flowers along with the fruits on the ground the leaves of the creepers produce fiber like roots which fix the plant to the ground and provide external support to grow further let's see some examples watermelon pumpkin musk melon you must have seen all these plants but now you understand why the fruits were lying on the ground because they are creepers we learned today five different types of plants based on their growth habit herbs shrubs trees climbers and creepers if you loved the video kindly like and subscribe to kids funzy laugh and learn channel please keep watching for now thank you